previously on Minecraft Quest for Home. Apparently I didn't record my voice over uh, while I was uh, recording the video. So, here, I'm coming at you through uh, video commentary. This right here, this is what we're going to do in this video, guys. We are going to build Nedwick's house. That is what this structure is here. I'm just giving a quick look at it. So we're trying to make a peanut, right? The name of this place is a peanut gallery. So my end goal is to make that look like a peanut. That's what we're trying to go for here. It's it's going to be massive. I mean, look at the thing already. And we're not even done yet. We're not even done yet. We're still building up. We're just still building up. So uh, we'll make a quick cut here again. And uh, I'll come back to you guys. All right, guys. We almost got it uh, covered up here. There we go. There we go, last couple pieces. All right, <laughs> there we are. Fourth floor complete. <laughs> Fourth floor complete. And right here, you're gonna see me uh, frame out. Uh, <laughs> I actually wrestle with this a little bit and it's actually pretty easy what I should have been doing, but I make it extremely difficult here and I think I fall a couple of times trying. But uh, basically we're trying to repeat what we did on the very bottom now. So we wanna go five oak wood, oak wood uh, blocks up. Uh, just like we did on the bottom, and I'm trying really hard to figure out exactly how I did that, but, uh, and then that oriented the wrong way. So we get rid of that, and uh, down it goes. See ya, Wood! <laughs> we'll pick that up later. We will pick that up later, guys. All right, and, uh, yeah. Yeah, so I'm, like, trying to figure out how I fall. <laughs> I just fall from the top. That's why we got Feather Falling 4, guys. <laughs> <laughs> that is what we got feather falling for but as you can see I'm trying to repeat what I have down here basically this little walkway here should be what's gonna be all the way above me up there so uh, it's just uh, I'm repeating the bottom section again uh, <laughs> I drop a wood th drop a wood there by accident and I make my way back up but again I'm not high enough so we're gonna uh, continue some dirt staircasing. <laughs> And uh, I'm going to go ahead and, uh, yeah, <laughs> I struggle with this so much until I realize. It, it's like it finally dawns on me. It's actually pretty easy what you can do here, guys. And you'll see me do it. It finally dawns on me eventually. So, uh, but yeah, I'm just putting these dirt blocks here for placement so I can orient the, uh, the uh, you know, the, uh, the oak wood uh, properly. Uh, I'll go back through after I'm done, and I'll cut down all the, I'll uh, dig out all the dirt and all the gravel, uh, you know, just clean it all up. But for now, that's what I'm kind of using as my guide. Yeah, and I'm back down here trying to figure out, like, how, how do I do this? I'm, like, counting blocks. <laughs> I'm, like, uh, three here, two here, uh, four here. And it, uh, when you find out, when you guys find out how simple it is to do what I was trying to do, uh, you're gonna, you're gonna kick yourselves, or kick me, I don't know. <laughs> Something's gonna get kicked, that's all I know. See, look at this, this is what I had to do, this was the easy part, this is all you had to do, guys. You just had to trace your, your little design, my floor design here, with dirt. Just dirt, same as we did below, where there is a one block, you know, a one block path all the way around the already existing roof that's all we had to do we do that and then we can start building back out again just go straight around your build like a so look at that isn't this much easier it's much easier to just make the path away and sneaking comes in handy here guys i'm, I'm doing a lot of sneaking here that's when you see me kind of teetering off the edge it's because i'm uh, i'm sneaking so there we go just like that and so now there is a dirt path Dirt blocks all the way around my uh, my floor, my ceiling, ceiling or floor, depending on which way you're looking at it, I guess. <laughs> but yeah, see, there's a dirt path all the way around here, guys. So and then I then you just go back through and you just put the wood logs down. And once you get these logs down, uh, it's smooth sailing. It's smooth sailing, man. I was trying. I was doing. I was. I was just making it too difficult. <laughs> I was just making it too difficult, guys. And so now here I am uh, going to just build this up five. So there should be five oak blocks right here, just like we did in the bottom. And 
the bottom area and uh and then uh and then and then we just kind of continue it up and then we'll cap off those five blocks at the top to make our final roof or well our final uh ceiling and then we build the roof on top of that ceiling if that makes sense <laughs> Because we're not just going to leave it flat, guys. We're not going to leave it flat up here. i got to make a roof on it. And that's a whole other challenge. <laughs> that is a whole other challenge. And look at... I, uh, oh, yeah. I think I need to get back down to get some supplies. And once again, I'm pretty high up. So, it just... There you go. Feather falling for... Don't fail me now. <laughs> All right. We're gonna, giving a little look-see around again. Just to see how our progress is coming. It's looking pretty good. And again, that dirt up at the top. Um, that dirt up at the top is going to be removed eventually. I just go back through with a uh, shovel and uh, shovel it all out. But i got to get back up to the top, which is the tricky part here. And I think I shovel up. Or no, I try to do a... <laughs> I try to make another dirt path. But I'm running out of dirt blocks now, guys. So I'm almost out of gravel. And I fall again. <laughs> Uh, fall again. It's a good thing you get Feather Falling 4. I guess that would be a good suggestion for you guys. <laughs> Before you do a tall build, uh, maybe you want to get Feather Falling 4 uh, on your uh, boots. Uh, or whatever you can get it on. I think it goes on boots. Um, so that you uh, so that you don't die when you fall down. Because inevitably you probably will fall down. <laughs> inevitably that's probably what will happen to you. All right, we got to go up five. So, just like so. Like that, like that, and that. So, it's not it's not an overly complex build. Uh, it's just got some patterning, I guess, that you need to pay attention to, I guess. It's not, it, obviously, it's not just like a flat, straight up easy build either. I don't know, it's... It's just uh, once you get once you get it started and get it going, it's uh, doing pretty good. So that's four blocks. I need one more block. Yep, five oak logs at the top here, guys. And again, that's just to kind of remember. I'm trying to go for a peanut-looking shape, right? I want it to look like a peanut because this is, of course, the peanut gallery, right? This is the peanut gallery where all the nitwits go. <laughs> look at the view. I changed my chunks to give me like way way more view distance, and it just Look at how much view you get from up here. It's amazing. It's amazing what that little change does. Now, I will say that if you do that, look, there's a nice little bay over there or something. Uh, but if you go this far in your chunks, uh, it does take a toll on your computer. Uh, but I only noticed, like, some lag uh, when I first log into the game. So when everything's loading for the first time, then you lag just a little bit so you get some frame rot. Uh, frame rot <laughs> frame rate drop but just look at this such a good view man i mean nedwick is gonna love this place right i mean you can look out at the whole world <clears throat> you can look out at the whole world and just yeah guys it's just oh it's just a it, it's just an amazing view but uh yeah yep yeah. but anyways continuing on with the build <laughs> continuing on with the build here we're gonna do the roof and i actually leave the uh the uh, the oak logs. I'm not capping them this time. I'm just kind of filling in the middle now, because this is the last uh, the last level. This is the ceiling. The ceiling of our uh, of uh, Ned Nedwick's house, right? The very top ceiling, and then on top of the ceiling, we're gonna build the uh, the the roof on it using uh, staircases, actually. So we're going to use oak staircases and uh, acacia staircases. And uh, you'll see how that comes out here uh, shortly. There we go. It is finished. The top of Nedwick's house is finished. And now all we have to do is put the roof on, which is going to be a whole, whole other challenge. <laughs> that is going to be a whole other challenge, guys. And just look at that. Look, you can look down at the spa. And there's the uh, there's the uh, stable that we made, and the spa looks really cool from up here. And then, of course, the Capitol building is going to look really cool. I th I hope uh, when I finally get around to making that as well. But uh, yeah, man, yeah. And anybody from the village around, if they're wondering where uh, Nedwick went. 
they can just like look right up here and be like, that's where Ned Wick is, right? If they look up here, they can see that's where Ned Wick is. <laughs> yeah, guys, so uh, we're getting close now. We're getting close, guys. All we have to do now is uh, put on a roof. We put on the roof, and uh, I think... I think we'll be in good shape, guys. I think that we shall be in good shape. <laughs> okay, guys, here we go. We are going to try to get the stair here. I got one acacia stair up, and I like to have a little overhang here on the uh, stairs. And I'm going to give you a trick here uh, for for stairs and placing them. Uh, you need to, uh, again, you need to, uh, orientation is uh, very, uh, very important when you're uh, making stairs. Um... You need to uh, be pointing your cursor right at a block. And uh, if you put it kind of towards the bottom in the middle, just like that, you get you get it facing straight out at you. But if I put something over here, see how I was kind of standing at an angle on that one, so it made it a little weird. And then I <laughs> try to get up here. Just gravel up, VB. There we go. <laughs> so I need to fix this uh, staircase here. Just like that. And uh, so this time we're gonna kind of point it uh yep at the bottom again you're trying to get your cursor right there at the bottom but i messed it up again uh, stairs can be uh kind of irritating at times but uh that's what you need you need to be right at the bottom and at the middle facing forward as much as you can and there you go you got the staircase like that gotta make another one there and i'm basically just building a stair just staircases on the overhang uh to begin with uh, which is what you saw me do there and then uh on this side over here uh do i go to that side next i think i do yeah so this side i need to face them going this direction and again at the very bottom in the middle there we go just like that same thing with there okay and then we need to get out to uh this next area and yeah see these corner pieces here that's uh i'll probably have to change those out for acacia uh acacia logs uh afterwards but i think i'll go ahead and continue building for the time being just to get these staircases up uh so this way is always going to be facing uh this part of the staircase is always facing uh the same direction yeah just like that and this is uh this is the tricky part first with the uh because i'm trying to uh i'm trying to get the overhang done but once i get the first initial stairs set uh become the process becomes a lot easier <laughs> ah, and i fall <laughs> i probably would have died had i not had my feather falling four so now i'm back down here trying to figure out how to get back up all right uh i did pick up some more gravel i believe yep so <laughs> i i abandoned my staircase completely and just uh gravel all the way back up to my roof so i can uh Continue and I actually go back down so I can put the staircases on this side. So we're going to start with acacia. We're going to have two sets of acacia stairs, followed by two sets of, uh, <laughs> and I messed that one up there, uh, followed by two sets of oak stairs before we actually top it off at the roof. And uh, I'm doing this basically just to kind of give it a little shape, you know, give the top of it a shape. <laughs> wow, VP did the same thing. <laughs> he did the same exact thing. You got to go over a little bit more, just a little bit more. And now you put it upside down. Good job, VP. Good job. And now we fall. <laughs> Building stairs from high places is not always the, uh, the the best thing. Well, at least now I can just gravel up and just plop the staircase right there. But I should have, I should have built that. Yeah, I should have built out one more. But hey, what can you do? What can you do? Let's get up here, point it at the middle, at the very bottom, and it should orient itself properly. Uh, yep, yeah, you, yeah, you can jump too. You can, <laughs> you can jump too. So it looks like you're looking down, but now it should be a little easier to place these ones. Yep, just like that. That's good. Yep, yep, yep. Going good now, like that. And we need one more right there. Okay. And now we got to do this side. So yeah, we're uh, just trying to get myself oriented right here. Nope, that's the wrong way, VP. That's okay. I get that one placed. We'll get rid of that one, and uh, then we'll put the uh, the new staircase down using our staircase we just put. There we go. Uh, and then this is another tricky one. This is where the sneak will come in handy. Or, or though I actually, 
I'm going to put a dirt block down underneath it for a guide. Uh, I need to get it up a little higher than that, VP. <laughs> and I'm out of dirt. But now I'm underneath it, so <laughs> at least that makes it easier. Again, I'm, I'm facing the uh, bottom of the... Uh, the bottom of the block there, and then I gotta get back up, so we'll use some gravel. <laughs> we will use some gravel, and I, now I just need to get this staircase in. It's get the, Yeah. Ah. <laughs> what am I looking for? What are you looking for, VP? I'm looking for something that I can use as a uh, guide block, and this is where... <laughs> Whoa! Why not? Hey, if you're ever... <laughs> In in need of using a different block. There you go. You can use some wool for a guide block and just pop up just like that. That's a lot easier to do it that way. I just, <laughs> that was all I had, man. I just had some wool on there. All right, so is our staircase done? Nope, still got to do that side. And oh, man, the sun is setting. The sun is setting. I believe this is the third night uh, that we've been out. Again, I think it's four nights before phantoms start showing up so uh i think i just continue to build here yep the tough part is over guys <laughs> so that's one layer of stairs all the way around and now we're going to add the second layer of stairs um just in front of these these layers right here so uh that is what we're going to do now this is a little easier oh i do replace this now i'm like okay let's get the acacia wood up here and I'm just doing that so we can get rid of that little that little that little speck of a uh, little speck of uh, oak wood that would be showing through otherwise because of the stairs being where they are. Uh, so I'm just kind of taking out the corner pieces uh, and in uh, yeah just replacing them with the acacia wood here. There we go. I think we are good now. But then I notice something is off. <laughs> it takes me a while to figure out what it is that is off. After I look at it, because the design should be the same, right? Should be the same all the way around. But if you look, it's like, wait a minute, what happened here? <laughs> There's two here, and one right there. But if I put this back down into oak, then it, then the corner is going to be revealed. So what did I do wrong? <laughs> what did I do wrong? That's what I, uh, I'm trying to figure out right now, and I believe it takes me a while to figure it out and I think what happened was uh, I didn't quite match up or I missed a block someplace I think is what happened we've got let's see a block right, a stair and a block right and then <laughs> a stair and block we did that VP and then we just got a stair we're missing a block there should be a block right here and a stair in front of it I need to get rid of this stair right and then put a block because it should be a stair and a block uh, so we got to put a block right here put an acacia block right in there VP let's drop drop the acacia block right in in that in that hole Wait, oh right there yeah put it in there put that yep okay get rid of that one get rid of that one and uh, we're gonna just drop the oak wood back in so now we got the shape is right again. <laughs> the design is right, right? The pattern is correct. <laughs> like so. Okay, so that's right. This is the one that's messed up, right? So let's go ahead and fall to the ground. <laughs> oh, man. Feather falling four for the win again. Oh, my goodness. How many times have I uh, fallen from this build, guys? <laughs> it has been quite, quite a lot. <laughs> no, I'm just... I was just kind of surveying what happened here and trying to figure out what went wrong. I get some more gravel out and begin my uh, ascent <laughs> back to the top of the uh, the uh, roof again. Figure out this crazy conundrum I'm finding myself in right now. <laughs> it's, it's just a block there. It's an acacia block right there, VP. You just put a put an acacia wood block and yep block we got a stair and a block but we got nothing there we got a stair and then yes a, a block and then a stair will need to go right over right okay and so now 
Now it matches. Now it matches, as far as I can tell. <laughs> These are the crazy things that you uh, run into when you're trying to do builds, guys. And this is the crazy things that can be so frustrating at times. But uh, looking back on them now, of course, we can laugh at it and be like, wow, what was I doing? <laughs> what was I doing there? Okay, now we're doing the second level. Now we're doing the second Acacia Staircase. So this is just... Uh, yeah, we're just popping them off right like that, and like that, and this one needs to go, yeah, I go with that side, that vantage, that perspective. <laughs> Words are hard, guys. <laughs> oh my goodness. There needs to be a stair there, a stair here, and a stair here, stair here. So I'm just doubling up the stairs. There should be two acacia stairs all the way across the top here for this first section of the roof and one more okay there we go guys two stairs two acacia stairs one's overhanging and one is uh right after the overhanging one so uh now now we have to build the oak wood stairs and then what i do here is i'm trying to figure out um, if I want to put more wood here, and I think I do bring these ones up. Yeah, I just bring this up one more level to give me a little base, uh, you know, just some some guide blocks. But these these guide blocks will probably stay here because uh, we're not going to be able to see this from inside the house. It'll just be like a little area uh, on the roof, um, basically. And it's going to be like a little cross space under the roof. <laughs> I probably could have filled it in, but uh, uh, that would be more more materials. That would mean more materials. So, uh, <laughs> of course, we're not going to do that right now, VP. We're going to get trying to get this thing done. Yep. So now we got the staircase there. Uh huh. And uh, yeah, now I'm looking at the blocks and like, should I bring this up or? What should I do with this? And then I think I decided to go with torches. I'm like, you know what? Let me just put some torches on these. One thing uh, about monsters is they can't spawn. Obviously, they can't spawn around light sources. And uh, they can't spawn on torches. Now, it's unrealistic to try to put torches on every block. And it would just look awful. <laughs> but if you can space them out in certain areas, uh, then it gets the job done. And that's kind of what I'm doing here. I'm just kind of making another pattern for some torch light here. Put a torch right there. <laughs> a torch right there. So, I don't know. Just gives it a little more light. Like I said, I could have just filled that in with blocks. And it would have been fine too. But I didn't feel like using the materials to do that. <laughs> so, yeah. And maybe it'll look cooler uh, when it's nighttime. And there's a little bit of light coming out of there. But, yeah. Hey. That is what we are doing, guys. We're getting up here pretty high, aren't we? We are getting up here pretty high. Uh, I do believe I'm, I'm probably telling everybody that uh, I'm going to try to finish the roof here. And then I'll see you guys uh, back after that. <laughs> so I think I cut away in that, you know, in my original video. But I guess I'll just stay with you guys here. I'll stay with you through my trials and tribulations in building this roof. <laughs> This might be broken into into parts like we did with our uh, nether portal, uh, our, 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 our nether area. <laughs> nether area? What are you talking about, VP? I don't know. Remember, I was up uh, all night last night because <laughs> I was working. And the night before when I originally recorded the audio for this, I, uh, I was up all night then. <laughs> So I probably should be sleeping at this moment in time. But here I am doing some commentary. So there you guys go. And hopefully you guys are enjoying it. If you are, please put a, you know, give it a like. Uh, subscribe if you haven't subscribed. Uh, hit that bell for notifications. And then you'll be notified whenever a new video goes up. So that's a handy, handy little tool to have. Uh, and it also helps out the channel quite a bit as well we gotta grow this man we gotta grow this i wanna i wanna share my uh my skills or lack thereof <laughs> with other people who enjoy playing minecraft and maybe turn some people over in the process to playing minecraft because it is a very fun game i actually been playing with uh my wife uh her and i have been playing uh, quite a bit i got her hooked 
on Minecraft. She was a big World of Warcraft fan. Uh, that was like the one game she was always playing. Either that, or and then she got in the she got in a rift for a little bit, and then a little bit into uh, Final Fantasy. Uh, was probably her most recent excursion until uh, I won her into the ranks <laughs> of uh, Minecraft, which is what uh, the two of us play together right now, actually. In a different world, of course. Not in this world. We got our own little our own little world out there. And uh, maybe I'll do a video where I kind of give you a tour of my other worlds. I actually got two other worlds right now um, that I could possibly... Uh, possibly do something with and i know uh one of my co-workers from work who i also got turned on to minecraft <laughs> yep i am uh, i am converting all the unconverted to minecraft <laughs> it's a fun game guys it is a fun game it's like unbridled uh creativity uh and it's just fun it's just i find it fun i find it relaxing and uh, oh <laughs> maybe i should get back to the commentary here yeah i'm putting more blocks down just to give myself a guideline, and then once I get that guide set, I can, uh, I can go ahead and, uh, yeah, just build, just build some stuff there. Just build the stairs off of that, and once I got one built, uh, yeah, I'm just gonna use the oak, the oak uh, wood for this. But let me, yeah, you know, put that up, and then once I got that built, I just hit the corner, the back corner now, is what I'm aiming for, and that makes it. Uh, match up like it is supposed to <laughs> but i believe i put oak wood blocks down there yep uh bring it up one more vp yep bring those up one more that's okay nobody's gonna see this <laughs> it's gonna be all covered underneath the roof uh it's just there for support <laughs> it's extra support there we go it is extra support all right we got that there and we got that uh there yep as well so just like that but anyways yeah minecraft man if you guys haven't played minecraft you should really play minecraft it's so much so much fun guys i, I and i think you you gain an appreciation for it the more you play it <laughs> and the more you watch other people play i know i've watched several videos now and uh i mean you can just get so much inspiration from watching other people play minecraft that you just got to get in there and you gotta play minecraft on your own <laughs> So, uh, so, yeah, if you're looking for a game to play uh, that's not too stressful, uh, then play Minecraft. You can even play it on your, uh, your cell phones now, your smartphones. There's apps for it. <laughs> All right, so we got, the, uh, we got it set up. Again, there's two oak wood staircases. So we had the two acacia, one hanging off, one on the right after that hang off. And then above those acacia staircases, we built two oak staircases up and now we're just gonna make uh, the flatten the roof using uh, the just acacia wood planks like this boom 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 and we say goodbye to those torches but uh at least the torches are in this little crawl space area <laughs> i mean we could make it into a crawl space once we start building you know hollowing out or once we start building the interior of uh nedwick's place uh we're not gonna get to that in this video unfortunately it took it took me quite a while just to build the exterior here uh so uh but that'll probably be in the next video guys uh, the video after this uh will probably be us doing the interior of nedwick's place and then we'll actually get nedwick up here <laughs> all right so yeah i built up the flat area and then i just just to give it a little more uh a little more you know just a little more dimension. I do add a couple blocks up here. Kind of make a little cross sign, huh? <laughs> right there. And then I put torches down. Important to have lots of light. I love uh, being able to see buildings in the nighttime. And then I just cap it off with two more there. Just to give it a little more, a little more of a, uh, uh, you know, a little more dimension. A little more height. Because uh, <laughs> it's not high enough. <laughs> And uh, hopefully this serves a couple different purposes. As you can see out there in the desert, hopefully I'll be able to look over here and see, oh, there's where the peanut gallery is, or if I'm out there in the ocean out there, 
uh, and I happen to be traveling around and for whatever reason I lose my place and don't know where my base is, I can look over here and be like, hey, there's something over there. <laughs> and all these torches will be here to show me, yes, indeed, there is something over here. So, uh, yeah, look at that, guys. Look. Nedwick's place. There's our house right over there behind the hill. You can't hardly see our house there. A little mining area. A little. I got several different mines. That's what those little buildings are everywhere. That's our original mine. That's a spider mine right there, guys. That's where we went in a uh, long time ago and uh, did the whole abandoned mine fiasco. <laughs> I've actually mined the crap out of that place. It looks completely different now. You wouldn't even recognize it from the first video that we did. And I'm going to gravel on down here. And, uh, yeah. And then we just got to get rid of all this extra stuff that's out here. Look at the wool up there. <laughs> it looks so silly. That's okay. It, it was just, it's just foundation, yeah. And then we start bringing all this stuff down. So, yeah, give me a few minutes here, guys. I'll get all this extra stuff tear, torn down. Uh, and then I'll, uh, I'll, I'll, I'll join back up with you. How about that? All right, guys. I think I got all the extra crap <laughs> taken off of the build now. <laughs> I'm just kind of doing another sweep to make sure I picked up all the materials that fell down uh, from the uh, build. But uh, yeah, now we can get a good look at our structure here. It looks a little different than how I did it in creative. <laughs> but I like it. I like it. Uh, it's not quite as peanut-y as I would like it to be. The texture's definitely there. The texture definitely says peanut gallery. Um, <laughs> or peanut. But uh, I don't know. It's still cool nonetheless, I think, right, guys? A little round building. Nedwick's going to like it. Nedwick will like it, that's for sure. Yeah, it's not too bad. We've got to get lights on it, but of course, uh, that's usually what I do last. I'll probably do that off camera, actually. Yeah, so not too shabby. Looks like a house that's uh, good to go for Nedwick, man. House that's good to go for Nedwick, and uh, that means that we got to get Nedwick up here. That's all we got to do now, guys. I mean, I got to do the interior of the house still, so that'll probably be the next video doing the interior of this house, uh, and that should be pretty cool too. So I hope you tune in for that when we get around to doing that video. But man, yep, we got uh, took us a while to do this, guys. <laughs> it took us a while to get this done, but I think, uh, I think, uh, let me get rid of these, <laughs> get rid of that stuff. Uh, and yeah, I'm gonna need to put some light in here so it doesn't become a monster spawning area. <laughs> Cause, uh, but that'll do. That'll be stuff that I'll do off camera more than likely. And then uh, when I come back with my next video, guys, uh, we'll do the interior of Nedwick's house. How's that sound, guys? We're gonna do the interior of Nedwick's house. Anyways, that's it for now, guys. The quest, the quest for home continues, guys. Minecraft quest for home. We'll talk to you later, guys. This is VP. I'm signing off. See you later. And hey, keep on gaming.